You're gonna move or what? Sir, what in my seat. What's going on in the aisle here? Uh, hey, Francisco, it's just me. Please. Who's talking? It's, oh, you don't recognize me? Come on, I'm, no, I'm your biggest fan. It's me, Danny Paella. Danny Paella. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm the head of the Northeastern chapter of the Francisco Guglielmi Fan Club. I have a fan club big enough to necessitate chapters, one of which is in the Northeast. Yeah! That's amazing. Yeah, and I'm the head of it. Well, well please, so tell me more about this fan club, Danny. Uh, okay. Uh, well, well we're, we're based in Trenton. Uh, Trenton makes the world takes. Sure does. Uh, we've, got, <laughs> we've got about uh, 6,000 members from Maine to Maryland. Uh, gosh, I know everything there is to know about your show, Mr. Guglioni. Uh, you, your very first show was April 20th, 1976. Mr. Guglioni was only five years old at the time. Uh, you, your very first guest was uh, uh, Mr. Monroe and his conversational squash plans. Squash plans are good talk. Oh, very good memory. so cool. It's so cool to finally meet you and like talk to you. Buddy. Well, I have to say it is a pleasure to meet such a dedicated fan. No! The pleasure's all mine! <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, I really have always wanted to meet you and I, I've got all these questions that I've wanted to ask. Would you mind since we're just we're talking about no, right no, I, I don't, I I don't mind at all. Okay, cool. I always have time for... I have a list. It's not a lot. Um, in season two, uh, episode 12, when you said true story, was it? <laughs> Actually, in that one, no. Wow. True story. Cool. Um, okay, in your 1977 Christmas special, was that really Anthony Daniels in a C-3PO suit, or was it just some guy? Will you sleep with me? It was just some... What? <laughs> Why is your checking account balance down to twelve dollars and thirty-seven cents? How do you know my checking account balance? You know I've got the socks that you are wearing for tonight's show. That's impossible. I'm wearing the socks for. How'd you get my socks? <laughs> you know I've been watching you. Yes, you said that you've been to every show, Danny. No, I've been watching you. Sometimes I follow you home after the show. And I stare in your window and I just watch. <laughs> right. You know, I, I've got a videotape of the actor that plays you making love to the whore that he met last morning. I shall call that making love, Danny! <laughs> <laughs> you want to see my impersonation of you? Not particularly. True story. <laughs> True story. <laughs> okay, that's a big deal, huh? Yes. Danny, Danny, I tell you what. Why don't you go backstage? Okay? <laughs> we, we have a green room with lots of refreshments marked security. Really? Just go back there and after the show, I will sign a headshot for you. Really? Yes. That's so cool. We are going to be the best friends. Yes. Yeah. Forever and ever. Cool. Okay. Backstage, back here. Security backstage, use force, please. Thank you. <laughs> The, the, the velvet ropes in the theater. Okay? <laughs>